Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Welcome back to my Let's Play of Life is Strange. Now, I just partly disagree with her. Before I say anything, I would say do not drift for us. You, you've got to think, if you're young and you watch this, you have really got to think about your school and future and college or or high school, whatever you call it in America, when you leave mate, leave school after 16, is it? I don't know. But still, we call that college. Um, but... She's my friend and I'd put my neck out for my friends every time and I do not think that's a bad quality or bad thing people should do. But yeah, I have got to be careful of her stuff in black crown. And what's she on about? She on about? I will have to sneak out. No, I'm not sneak out, I'll walk out the door. No way he can stop me. And if he does try stopping me, then there's kidnapping. Then he'll get thrown in prison. But there we go, let's carry on. Let's go Chloe. Hard to believe Chloe was my BFF just five. You're giving me a look I haven't seen for a while. What's the mm. problem? Why steal a gun from your stepdad? You know you're gonna get busted. Or somebody like Nathan will bust me with a cap. Screw that. I need to cover my own back. Your stepdad won't let you off the hook that easy. What the hell does he need another gun for? To mow down Bigfoot cheerleaders? This is all just so scary. I know, Max, but I do feel safer having a 9mm in my pants. Well, I don't. Guns make me nervous. You should be playing guitar, not playing with a gun. When assholes stop threatening me with guns, then I'll stop playing with mine. Your mm. gun can't stop a bullet in your back. No, Max, can't. I'm not looking for trouble. I just want protection. If anybody in this country should have guns, it should be women. But the more you play with guns to defend yourself, the more trouble you can get yourself into, I would say. And it's that attitude that's wrong. Women should have guns more than men. No, it's individuals. The entire thing of guns is dodgy, in my opinion. But I live in a no-gunner country. So I don't completely understand what it's like. Max, open the window and we can blow this popsicle stand. Because really, it's the individual that's dangerous, not the gun. Guns don't jump up and shoot people. People use the gun and shoot people. I'm not women not any safer than men, men not any safer than women. Well men are a bit the more dangerous men. Most crimes and crimes are made by men. But still, it's individuals. I'm a bloke and I'm a perfectly nice guy. I'm so I'm a psychopath, so Isn't this awesome sauce? Totally reminds me of when we were kids. Come on, slow poke! Hold on. You let one of my friends miss. I'm like, uh, I haven't come been on. here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Oh my goodness, me it is. The lighthouse is oh my goodness. That's just creepy. What was this over here? Hello, cute little squirrel. Aww. You and me. Stare contest. Please stay in this country and don't come in mine. And to kill all my little brown squirrels. Red squirrels. <laughs> Lol. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. Yeah, right. This is creepy. Oh, water. No, no, water. Okay, what's what I'm going to say? Here we go. You're right now. Okay. You're my white knight woman here. You are worry about me. I owe you thanks for today. 
I'll be back later. Cool, I swear. And you, and you still tell me your big secret. Don't about that. Hmm. Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Yeah, but then they've got to put up the wind, and the wildlife, and the rain, and the thunder and lightning. It's not all paradise, but that's what you say. I wish I could fly away sometimes. Now, um, is that James Blunt? No, not James Blunt, Annie Lennox. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. How long has that been here? Clearly, the Bigfoots are everywhere. Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. <laughs> Them movies are good. But most of them anyway. <laughs> Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. Okay, glyphs. I have to remember that. Those sure aren't big feet. What kind of animal left those prints? Baku? I don't know. <laughs> Fox? Sure you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. My pleasure. Feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. It's okay. You have to live with him. Has mm. he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home. I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah. I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it! He's so hella fucking paranoid! I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? <laughs> He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. Okay. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. How much do you owe? Three grand plus interest. And before I could get a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my drink with some shit. God, oh. Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. Yeah. <sighs> Max, it was oh. insane.
Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. <laughs> I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. <laughs> Sweet. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. I can turn back time. Just saying. This <laughs> shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'm I'd here. like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. I said, I told you it's a deer. Didn't I tell you it's a deer? I knew it's a transfer.
October 11th? Is this Friday? That's only four days away. Oh no. That tornado is headed straight for the town. Yeah, right. Four days. No, you listen. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real. It's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had this same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi? Right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. <sighs> What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. <laughs> Tell me everything. Have you listening to me? Lola. There's JK. I mean, J.A. Jackass. That's what we call him, J.A. So there's no music, but I'm... Sh I'll find something. <laughs> I hope like the previous one on the radio. We're doing that again, obviously. Same CD. Pardon me. My that's the end of season one. We'll see what happens. I have to find her. Don't know what I'm to do about her. He's a poo poo head. What are you doing there? He, he seems alright. Seems like a cool teacher. Just a teacher though. Not be funny. He's my friend, but I think he's a bit creepy. But there we go. Files. Yeah, there's a foot. That's episode one. Let's just skip that. Okay, you employed Nathan 65%, you hid from the truth 35%. Okay, with her, you made fun of Victoria 26%, you confirmed Victoria 74%, and I didn't, I made fun of her. I think that's a safer option, personally. And the top one, that's dangerous, but personally, I think that. If people don't stand up against people that are no good, then things don't get fixed, and nothing, and companies don't get sorted out, and bad people don't get put away. People have to, good people have to stand together to link in, fix these things. So that's my base on that decision. Okay, the third one. You intervened to help out Kate. Eighty-three percent of people have done it. I could people done it. Eighty percent of people done it. That's good to see that. Because that's the right thing to do. Of course you help your friend. It's risky but it's your friend. You came out to hide to You came out of hiding to intervene. No. 
you intervene. Oh, that one's eighty three percent. You come out high into intervene. Only thirty five percent done that. One percent blame Chloe, you son of a gun. You're a lovely person, aren't you? Not Shocking. Oh Chloe. It was Chloe, but that's beside the point. You came out of hiding doing the thirty five percent. Yeah. Thirty seven percent and started hiding. Hiding. I can understand that. I don't think that's the right option, but there you go. We'll see what happens next. You let Daniel draw your portrait, 44%. Uh, I was on the majority. You didn't let Daniel draw your portrait. Yeah, fair enough, don't know why. It's only a portrait. You didn't sign Mr. Grant's pendant, 55%. Mrs. Grant pendants. Can't remember what that was. You helped her, eighty-one percent nice. Yeah, of course, a ball in the back of the head, too right. You helped, but that's not nice. You didn't erase Kate's slate, fifty-four percent. I didn't know I could erase the slate. And why do I want to do that? Kate's my friend. Kate's cool. Okay. You watered the plant. Well, of course I watered the plant. I would be with the majority of people on that one. Because, well, well, the majority of people say they would, did what the plan, which they did. Because, well, I'm, I'm a gardener. I'm a, I'm a trainer, I'm a, a qualification horticulture, so yeah. Um, you didn't touch Daniel's, I mean, Dana's pregnancy test. 98% of two people didn't. That's good, because when I looked on YouTube, every video I found they did. Which I thought was absolute shocking and invading somebody's privacy. Because I see 98% of people agreed with me. That's nice to see. You didn't touch Victoria's photo. 74%. 9%. Good, good, good. You didn't wear on a dirty RV. I write on the dirty RV. 79%. No. That's just being childish. when we growing up. You let the bird die. 56%. What bird? I let the bird die. Oh no! I let the bird die. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, well, it's a game. You broke. You broke Harry's snow globe. Eleven percent. I didn't break it. Yay! No, you did. Oh no. Whoops! I read it wrong. That's a shame. I remember that. Okay. You left evidence. Well, searching through David's stuff. Yeah, I did. 18%. I forgot the rewind time on it. Bad mistake. That's going to bite me in the future. You read David's file. 64% did. And that's it. B to exit. Oh! Oh no! Harry! That's not happening. I'm not having that. Why are we playing on the railway tracks? You s meant to be growing up. Oh my goodness. Even as a child, that's stupid. <sighs> really? Really? <laughs> really, kids, there's a plan. Don't do it. In the end, you do that, you'll get yourself killed or seriously hurt now i gotta go guys and i'll be back when i can afford the next episode of life is strange bye for now <laughs>